Okay, last time. What were we doing? We did a lot of things. In Midgard. And then... Well, I mean, we're just exploring for the Fates, right? So here are the Norns. Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head enter the home of the Norns, tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son! son. <laughs> You know the child is an Asgard. No, you see what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. Oh, he fails. <laughs> you come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts. God dang, that armor As looks if good. knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak, Speak plain. Plain. <laughs> You will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you, but called, you called him, him the destroyer, destroyer of fate. fate. There must, there must be a way, way to subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. The protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable. Merely make us seem prescient. When, when my son was born, born shut up! up! <laughs> Your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did... It was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exeunt only. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in Storycraft. We are yeah, leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, he <we're> angry. <laughs> Well, that was educational. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Let us leave this place. Happily. Things getting more normal already. Wait, that tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy? Will not happen. 
Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. Whoa. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. <laughs> Okay. Kratos, I see something. Oh. Does this go anywhere? Let's see. I think this goes, uh. That's the wrong way up if you want to get out of here. Look, I think we're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe- The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No, but Baldur's fate had many causes, prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur, and so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my Your nature. Well played, Norns. <clears throat> Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Okay. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake. Though, I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. Hmm. Hmm. Give me one sec here.
Okay. Brother, about the oracles of your lands, would you say they manipulated events? Did they have an agenda? I do not doubt they held their own interests first, but in my experience, they could be easily fooled by their own prophecies. But enough of that for now. I want to do that, uh, I got time. We got time. I want to do that one I ran away from. <laughs> that one mission. Or area. I think over here. Brother, what you said before about the oracles of your land being fooled by their own prophecies, I get the sense that was coming from personal experience, eh? Yes. Once, I sought the oracle for a means to break my bondage to Ares. One priestess had visions that showed her Olympus would be brought to ruin by the god of war. Brother, what's wrong? The wolf cannot focus. Let's see how bad this is. So we got this. A gold chest. All right. <laughs> Tartarus Rage to destructive plate for land. What's this? Okay. Okay. Huh. Kind of the same for both, kind of. Okay, where's the rest? Nope. Wait, um... I can assume what I need to do. Maybe. Okay. Okay, one more. Where is oh, that probably is it. Apple. 
That's good. Need one more. And I think that's it. Alright. Alright, alright, let's head home. They still whine. Poor thing. They can smell more danger. Uh, the wolves fear that which can no longer hurt them. The horrors of our past can be inextricable from the present. You have to understand that. Can we get back to what you were saying about the oracle of your homeland? She had visions of Olympus being brought down. Yes, by the god of war. Therefore she helped me, intending to undermine Ares and protect her realm. She did not foresee that I would kill him and take his office. But we will continue another time. Like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Okay. Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. <laughs> When in doubt, ask the dwarfs. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? Oh dear, oh dear. What's to be done? Oh god, more what missions. What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nethog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the Lindworms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned worms will be a walk in the park. All that said, I'm happy to discuss anything else on your mind. Okay. Something else to do? Anyhow, was there something else you wish to talk about? No. They're back. They're back! Simmer down, I see them. Blades of Chaos. Always a joy to work on these. Uh, shield. It's this one. Increases the timing window on parries. Ooh. Ooh. I like that. Cool. Their deaths will be painless. If. That ought to hurt him. We'll see how that goes. What was the other one I was using? I was using this one, right? Whoops. <laughs> okay. Armor. Whatever you need, I'll create. Whoa, that looks cool. When using a runic attack or relic to immediately, immediately restore 70% of its cooldown. 
Okay. Level seven. Level nine. I don't know when I'm gonna get another one. We'll see what happens. Would have been a shame to have left that behind. Um, what can I make? Wrist armor. Oh wait, wait, let me see. Ooh, that's really good. Hmm. Fits. But, uh, I'll stay, I'll keep it like that. Okay. I'll disinfect and... my tools. Resources. And that's it. Now I'm poor. <laughs> so. A fan of your crest? Quite the prize. I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh. Wow. Okay. Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. <laughs> Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do but... Go fetch Dropnir. Okay. I can't fathom what they have in mind, but... If it's a weapon against Heimdall, we can use it. Yes, I was supposed to actually stay. Drop me up. I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Drop me We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. I will help me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. <laughs> We're our teeth. But to even store Dropnir, you need... You were saying. Uh -huh. A secret passage. So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. What is this? Uh, like a bunch of rings? Oh, I'm gonna miss you, little one. I feel it in my controller. <laughs> Got it! I think. All 
can't recommend. I, I, I cannot recommend the haptic feedback enough. It's like very subtle, like shaking. Uh, every once in a while, kind of reflect on like what's going on in the game. Like I felt the horse trotting on the water. It felt kind of cool. <laughs> like you could feel like which foot was like not was taking the step. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention we'll have to visit... ...the lady. The lady. Oh. <laughs> oh. Whew, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. <sighs> Kratos? Whenever you're ready. <laughs> okay. I think we're ready. The lady? No idea what he's on about, brother. See you out there. Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh no! This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. You oh. heard him. What's your friend? I ain't gonna mess nothing up. Yeah, Brock. What uh -oh. the? <clears throat> no, you pimping shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Think the fuck again. <laughs> what's with the what was with that? Was the egg bad? What was all that then? Oh, just Sentry trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in need of a rear been making a buttery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates did never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. What are y'all doing over there? You want to get a weapon made, or you want to plunge into oblivion? Because you can't do both. Okay. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned uh, service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock, and he's gone. Yeah, you sure where you go? The right pick for this brother. Oh I God. Trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Okay. Um. It's like red for the wrong one. We may need to work together on this one. There. We keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Can't pick up that stuff. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Okay. So, a tunnel for liquor and explosives. Ooh, I got hurt. A little on the nose for dwarven culture. Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, all right. Might have earned that one. Ah, oh, break it.
I have no idea what I was doing at that part. At that part. I was being a little cocky. Oh no. Wow, you're gonna ask me to do that? How to get the stuff again? Ridiculing the culture you helped undermine. Okay, now we're good. Interesting. So I have to do this in like one run. Careful, brother. Not. That looks flammable. That's weird. An abandoned service tunnel. There. Okay. We keep cooperating. And why is this just randomly up here? What are you insinuating, uh, oh. Highness? Is there anything behind here? No? Okay. Okay, let's think about this. I'm gonna get no. Ah, a fortuitous oil spill. I hear stuff. I want to blow it up. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> I was like fumbling. I fumbled it. Trying to like change my <laughs> change my uh, weapon and uh, trying to hit it with the arrow. Nasty hit. You already hit. Not that glendary before it poisons it all! What is hitting me? Okay. Another one. And 
I'm almost dead. I hear Sindri. Sindri, you'll just have to wait. Thanks, uh... Oh, Sindri, they're there. Is that you? Yes. I need to talk to Kratos. Um, okay. Let me just look at what this is. What the heck? Oh, I don't think I was supposed to do that. Hmm, it's even farther now. Let's come back to it. Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask her. <laughs> but. Oh dear. Okay. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again. You're insinuating and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our Oh, okay, heavy runic attack. Ooh, that's a tough one. 206 seconds. And it does not come back very fast. Well, 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 I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Okay, so... I'm assuming... These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. What is this? Okay. If I let go, I'll do this. I'm guessing maybe freeze it. And do this. Oh, I see. Not quite. Just find the right angle. Just the right angle, I see. The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. Just gotta find the right. Oh. Wow, that's so. F oh, that's finessey. Oh, that's finessey. Okay. Beep. That's a it's very open. finesse angle. Okay. Alright. Oh no. I get hit like a hunter at first. Of course, I should have, uh, should have gone the other way.
Oh god. Well, that was a bloody heartier sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. We'll need to get one of those gates open. One of these gates open. Um... Oh, there's a puzzle and a half. What am I looking at here? Okay. Okay. Ah, you've seen these troughs before, haven't we, brother? Yes, we have. Don't tell me. We've got this. Oh, well, we got water. Maybe. Nope. Nope. I'll wait till we can redirect the water to get that wheel turning. Yes, I can tell. We need to redirect the water. Where does this go? Uh. Oh, here we go. Oh, I see. That worked. Shall we? So does that one. What about this one? This one doesn't work. Me too. This opinion of yours, was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok? That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't, or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting I my- I know. I know. And we both know the place is protecting your child can take you. Oh great. Okay. Sigil arrows won't work on this. Got the third one hidden away. Of course, they have like behind boxes. This is enough. Nope, we need one more. Where is it? Healer. 
Oh, it's dying. Okay. I guess I got it. Okay, that does that. But I think I have to do it this way. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with the disparity in size. Or number of limbs, say. Nothing in the world. Oh, we got a luminous alloy. That's that's good. Okay. Where to? Let me get this. So... Guess we just go up here. <laughs> ah, this turns on the water. Okay. There. Now we can open the other gate. Why is it you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. Nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything you haven't thought. Her secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talked to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put this you on. This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. Oh no. Something here. You're right. It's not for me to say. Oh, that's... Oh, oh right. Oh no. Please give me time. Oh, give me time. <laughs> that was bull crud. Okay, 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 okay. I was hoping he would give me time to, you know. Ah! 
for some fresh air after that. Everyone thought so. It is close. I can feel it. Yes, 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 yes. Let me just look around for stuff and then I, uh... Let's see what this is about. Oh, boy. Okay. Nothing too bad. I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about this. Ooh, Asgardian Ingot, yes. That's good. Okay. We can actually upgrade the armor. When we get out of here, I'll give you some space. Let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon. And to use it. <coughs> Alright, where do we come I'll out here? I can learn while we're here. And Maybe we I'll are... Maybe I'll send you here, back to Valhalla for good measure. Well, you have fun oh. now. Hey, hey bro. You made it. About time. I got everything. Looks like all the set. train tracks. Now we just got to push on up to the Funky. And she's leaving. Okay. You sure did go to pains coming here busting old tear loose. What a prize he turned out to be, huh? Up. It's time to steal my kitchen. <laughs> Better take out that nest or it'll be eyeballs down here. <laughs> believe I have to turn off music, right? Right here. Hang on. Almost got it. There. Well, come on in, stranger. I never do get used to that trick. <laughs> There's nothing out here, right? up ahead. Act civilized and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, what's your nattering? You snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear. Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? Yeah, so. Oh, there's a chest. Don't mind me. You see oh, what's wrong here, don't you? Those creepy flying eyeballs made a nest up on the cables. We gotta figure a way up there and clear them all. <laughs> oh, wow. They're up there! Is it that way or is this way? That just goes nowhere. Uh oh, which 
Where are we going, Brock? That ain't coming back down till we deal with that nest up there. Oh. Come on. Let's try to get close. I was ahead of him. Okay. <sighs> okay, looks like that wheel up there opens the gate. Now that we can. <laughs> <laughs> Where does this go? No crap. Okay. Why don't you look around and see if there's a way to lift this lift? That does that. Now we're talking. Hang on, coming around. Brother, well, got that. Did you notice the dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Block than they were to see you? They did seem surprised. All right. Now I can turn this plane, Captain Guys. You just give me the signal when you're ready. Okay. No. <laughs> What do you want me to do with this one? Ugh. I just want to play my games. Please leave me alone. <sighs> What is he? What are we supposed to be doing? That got the gate open, but you kind of need to be up here to use it. You dig? Turn it. Copy that. Turn it again. Figured it out. Doesn't matter, Once you can more. just do this. Look around! Find an angle! Ain't this what you do? Again. <laughs> ah, promising. Oh, come on. Okay. Finally! Now we can ride on up to the board. Come on! Oh, we have a chest. Hey, got another riddle for you. What gets better the more you take away from Well, let's see. Something abstract, I expect. 
Appetite? No, that doesn't work. It's a heavy runic attack. Uh oh. Looks cool. Sure. Oh, that takes so long to recover. Well, we'll try it. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? Okay. What was the point of this? Um. Somehow it brought this back up. Or back up. That's brisk. He go grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Oh, watch and learn. See, dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? Huh. The nature of a thing's more important than the form of a thing. <laughs> Hang on. I smell trouble. Oh, ah! to the rescue. <laughs> oh, that hurt. Oh, that hurt. creature in this whole realm. Why, I've been waiting for my chance to meet her since I was knee-high to a Noken. But Sindri had never had it. Said I was too uncouth. But today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> my bro, I've never seen you so reverent. Are you nervous? What? Shut up! No, fuck you! It does not work. Eh? What is it this time? Out of the way! Let me look! Oh, fuck no! Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city my own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things, follow me! Yeesh, this place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. Which one? This one? Oh, this one. This lady. What does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessing. Doesn't give them to every piece. But the one she does, there's something to behold. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster. Maybe sometime I'll spin you that tale. Faye's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from the taste in men. Yeah. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. I'm assuming this one. 
Back in those days, I'd get so caught up in trying to be the best that I'd work till I plumb drop. Time goes by and there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own pace. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Like her when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. It gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? <laughs> desire <laughs> only grows <laughs> when you take away the thing you desire. <laughs> All right, it's not perfect, <laughs> but let's hear your answer. <laughs> you won't get it out of me, Daddy. <laughs> Get back to bed. One more crank to turn and it's on to the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to the nature of it. I was almost following him for a moment there. We're good. Crank it. Underwater. Here she comes. I, um, uh, uh, I, uh, She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her your head. I wonder if this is a reference to like the Lady of the Lake. Although in that case it would be like King Arthur. Don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. 
Pop specifically, you might be missing. Fuck. Fuck! Mm. Damn it, Sindri, you lion cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! The fuck you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters. It's the... Not its form. It's the thought that counts. This weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. can't let you take our new gal home without giving her a twirl. Look! We got volunteers! Oh, God. Oh, wow, that was very forgiving. Uh, that was very forgiving on the, on the parry time for that one. I'm trying to parry. Now you know I, I hate parrying this like these things. Skills, right? Okay. Hold triangle to slam the spear down with even more command, increasing the strength of the resulting detonation. Um, can be done when triangle is pressed momentarily after any drops. Okay.
R2 can be held during gale force to pull in nearby enemy. Oh, you can siphon. Siphon spears do elemental damage and can be, can be thrown, pound, and detonated. The element is lost on using a spear runic attack or after a combat has ended. While evading... yeah, that looks good. And then the charge, okay. Ooh, that's expensive. I might need that. Um, okay. Up there, see that weak spot? Jam one in right there. Yep. Guess we're doing this one boy style. 